do you see Salah as a gift? Well, that's a great question. Actually, um, one thing I do find in my own life is that when I am really kind of focused in Salah or when I'm more able to be present in my Salah, my, I do feel a lot more at peace. So um, things, you know, uh, as we say, storms never, you know, you can never control the weather, right? You can't, you can't tell it not to rain. You can't say, you know what, I don't want it to rain right now, stop raining. But what you can do is you can kind of go into the shelter, you can wear an umbrella, you know, you can hold an umbrella, you can wear a coat. And I feel like Salah is like that umbrella. It's like that shelter. It's like that coat where the weather doesn't stop. The weather may not change in your life, but you have more protection from the weather and it doesn't affect you as much. It doesn't, um, you know, in the analogy, it doesn't make you wet. You know, it doesn't drown you. It, you. You can handle your life a lot better. That's, you know, when, when you're able to really, uh, I think, when you're consistent in your prayer, and as you mentioned, on time in your prayer, and when you're able to be present, I think it really serves as a protection from the weather of life. <laughs>